Hey, Symphony, where do you think you're going? To, to Bebo's house, to, to Papa's house to spend a night. Oh man, we're sure we're going to miss you. Yeah. Are you sure you got everything packed up? You don't need to bring anything else? Baba, I got Baba. it all packed up. <laughs> Mama, I got everything I, I need packed up. This is one of the downsides of vlogging so far. See that pile of mail? I just pulled all this mail out of the mailbox. That's probably over, probably over a week's worth of mail. When's the last time you checked the mail? Oh, it's from Bradley Bray. Um, well, it's been it's been weeks on my part. I haven't checked it in weeks. <laughs> We used to check it every day before we started vlogging. That used to be part of our daily ritual. Go outside, walk with the kids, Sparkle check the mail, and go shine. through it. Oh, that is so cute. Caitlin is so crafty. Oh my gosh. It's Bradley Cotton birthday time. She's one. That's adorable. Look, it's little Bradley's birthday invitation. Isn't that pretty? Would you like to hold She's it? Speechless. <laughs> Party will be held at our new home. What I'm most excited about in this mail is my new Rangefinder magazine. Did you guys hear I made the 30 rising stars of wedding photography inside the rangefinder? No, I didn't. Maybe one year though. We got like, I think there was like four, three people from Texas who made the top 30 rising stars of wedding photography. And I was not one of them. Abram, where's your hand? There's your nose. Where's your hand? Where's your hands? Hands. Oh, there they are. Where's your teeth? Abram's learning, learning his body parts. Where's eyes? Where's your eyes? Eyes? Len, Len, eyes? Len, Len, Len. Symphony, what do we got going on? Let's start over. What? We're gonna, we're gonna spend the night at Bebo's and go exploring. We're heading to a garage sale, and it's kind of a random one in the middle of nowhere in Kaufman. But this yard sale, or garage sale, has a garage full of wreath supplies, like big rolls of mesh and all just all kinds of stuff. I should show you guys the photo. Let me see if I, oh, I don't have it. But anyway, so I'm going and I'm hoping to find a good left. deal. After the holidays, business tends to slow down and I do a lot of um, auctions. I already do a lot, but I'll do like bulk auctions where I sell like several things in one setting. Is Abram asleep? I think she likes them. Caitlin, you're gonna have to buy those. She likes them. I, I guess I'm gonna have to buy a purple <laughs> ornament. <laughs> so we're selling ornaments here. These are $1.50. They're very more. The regular is $3, but I don't think there's an original bulb that were in this package. It's kind of a jip out here. This guy's definitely out to make a buck. Not to sell his stuff. <laughs> Oh man, maybe I need to go through the ribbons. I know, I like the ribbons. Here's some yarn or string. Is that yarn? There's no price on it. Oh, I it's think a that would be like, mm. I don't oh, know what that is. Somebody in material. I feel like that was, this is good stuff to have like for next year, for fall even. Yeah, that's what I was kind of. Yeah, that's I'm Halloween. I bet he'll go down on them. I feel like if I just say, get this bin and say, dollar? will you take like 20 bucks for this one? Negotiate a dollar, honey. Yeah, but why would I have all this stuff if I just said, can I have the whole bin for $30? Right, so they're quite complicated. Here's some Christmas Seriously. ribbon. I know, I like that. I like this Burger one too. Burger six bucks, selling it for two. I really like this. I ain't bad. No, this one, the black one. What, buddy? <laughs> I like this a lot. The classy Christmas. Yeah, it's like cool. That? Hi, Abram. One fifty. <laughs> I know what this guy does. He buys these on sale after Christmas and then waits till Christmas the following year and then marks up the prices and gets a little profit on these. Because some of these look new, still in the box, but old, as if like they've been sitting out for a long time. Smart. Got a little entrepreneur in there. Hey, here's some Reese you can just sell. <laughs> Sipney, here's some books. Look, questions and answers. This looks cool. You like that book? Uh, we, really, we didn't even Needle mosquito. 
turn the page. Let's see what's on the other pages. We just opened it today. Oh, there's doors on all the pages. Oh, really? Yeah. You got it quick. Yeah. Let's read one. Yeah. It says, How does a plant grow? You open it up. It starts as a tiny seed in the earth. First, a little seeding appears. With water and sun, it grows and grows. Seed, seeding, plant. And there's the sun and the rain. This is a cool book. I like it for you. It's like exploring in the side of a book. This is a cool book. I might get this for you. I like it. Oh, he's an artist too. It's like the hardest. It's so not fun. Do you want to play? Look at Bradley. Don't you play? Hey, Bradley. That's cool. Who's the artist? Hey, that's a nice tree. That's actually pretty cool. Nia, your mom has one of those trees in her yard. Mama Yeah. Who's the artist? Your wife? Yeah. Cool. His wife's an artist. She's good. Give thanks to the Lord. I just don't understand how Oh, this looks snuggly. This is pretty cool. $50 kit. It's probably worth it. All these oil paints. Look at this. That looks like 50 bucks worth of stuff. I'm tempted to start painting just looking at it. I have a bag of stuff. She's got just a pile of stuff. She's got a drippy nose for her debut. Oh, cute. Oh, I want to buy the baby. Yes. Let's take him home. We just decided to meet up here. Less, we're crafters, and we were like, we're gonna go to this yard sale and see what we can get. This is what I'm taking home. I found a couple of kids on the curb. Hey, do you guys have parents? Daddy, you're my parents. I was playing a game. You're supposed to play with me. Do you guys have any parents? Yes, you, you and, and, the, and the mommy over there are my parents. <laughs> So I got an awesome deal today, you guys. It didn't seem like it at first because everything was marked the price that I, I get it on sale for, just about anyways, like maybe a dollar cheaper than what I already paid for it. And she did give me a little bit of a discount. I got quite a bit of stuff for only $30. Oh, I didn't know that door was there. I'm vlogging, Shadow. What's up, guys? What's up? I'm an overnight. <laughs> hey there, boy. Hey there, baby. Off to grandma's. This is Papa's. Papa's, grandma's. She couldn't believe she got your home. Give me a hug or I just get to the hug. One day mom said, uh, 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 while, I, while I was sleeping and I couldn't find Chewy, um, mama said I had a chew on cutie. Okay. <laughs> Cute shirt, Bebo. Thanks. <laughs> Hi, Jimmy. How are you doing? It's hey, true. Yeah. So, have you taken off your shoes already? Uh huh. They got so Nia, move your boot. Hot. <laughs> they got so hot. Your, oh, yeah, your shoes got, got so hot or your feet got so hot? My, my what are you doing, so Bobby? Your feet got hot, didn't they? Uh -huh. Look at him dangling his feet. Because mom took for a long time. Look over here. Don't eat it yet. Just look at me. Daddy's going to get a picture of us. <laughs> Oh, that's cute. I have a whole bunch of Beanie Babies here at my mom's house, my mom and dad's house. This is where I grew up and I have a ton of Beanie Babies in here in the closet. And I read an article that all the spider eggs were planted back in the day when we all were buying Beanie Babies and that they should all start hatching soon. So that I'm gonna so go. That is so creepy. I know. I, I know saw that, that article. Real. They said they packed them with uh, spider eggs? Yeah, like Instead. baby spider eggs. And it's been like 10 years now. Oh, and and they're they said they're hatching. Back up. Why do we have to back up? Oh, what is that? She's the same. She's the same height you were, Nia. Really? Is that Nia's? When you were four. That's where Nia started. We started doing no Nia. Eggs on oh. oh, really? Yeah. So she no was that tall at ten years old. Oh, this is cute. Stand right up against there. That's how I kept them. Never mind. Same height. Wow. Spider eggs. Yeah. Three. She's the same height as you. Oh. When you were four years old. Sissy, that's so cute. Yeah. You so no spiders. Yeah. No, no spiders. It's a pizza house. Me a baby. Me a mommy. You can get it out. Different times throughout the year when you do really good things and make mommy really proud or daddy really proud, you're going to get one. It'll be little surprises for you when you do big accomplishments or really sweet things to your brother or for mommy and daddy. Okay? So the bunny looks cute. 
Well, I was gonna surprise you with one, but you want the bunny this time? Mm -hmm. Okay. The bunny's cute. They, and they all have that, names. That is cute. <laughs> you open up the box and take it out. They all have names too. Take them out. What's What's her name? Did you and Bebo collect all these together? Mm -hmm. This one is Nibbler. Bebo stood in line. <laughs> Did you stand in line? For days. Twitching her nose, she looks and so sweet. And both those. Guys, look, I found a little kitty. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Oh, a mirror. Look at that. It's a beautiful mirror. Hi, guys. <laughs> I bet this is where I used to shave. This is a cool shot right here. Isn't it? Oh, there's a razor right here. He does shave right here. What a cool place to shave. I've never shaved outside before. Come out here butt naked in the morning and shave. While the sun is rising over here. Cows in the foreground. What year is on the calendar? December 1994. It's not that old. Actually, that's pretty old, but... Just see it's all sun-baked. Look at the onions hanging up here. <laughs> How cool is this? He's got some more onions, little ones, just drying out in the sun. Look at this old refrigerator. This is cool. I bet he's got some beers in there. Kidding. Oh, no beers, more tools. Those are the clean tools. Say moo. Say moo. Mm. Moo. <laughs> No, not a dog. They don't say, or, or, they say moo. It's a cow. Can you say cow? Is your finger itching? I'm sorry, baby. Hey, you say cow? Moo. <laughs> that's a pretty scape. I need to get more in there. Yeah, that's a good one. What are you guys doing, Stephanie? The mm. time, Daddy. Mmm. I saved, I saved a few. That's all I got out of the whole tree. Is this where you shave, Jimmy? Hmm? Is this where you shave? No, it's a... You know, There's a razor right there. Yeah, I know. I use it. I shave it back my neck when my neck get, hair gets real long. Oh, okay. A then, kitty cat, Mommy! This, this thing here used to be at the cotton gin. People a, a long time ago used to shave with it. Oh, it is a shaving mirror, though? Cotton gin. Oh, cool. He's got screws inside that turtle shell. Terrapin. What? Terrapin shell. A terrapin shell, which is like a turtle. Isn't that cool? Mm-hmm. Is this where you store some screws too, Jimmy? Show us how this works here. Yeah, I got them in there. My thumb right here. It tacks right there. <laughs> cool. <laughs> you nail your lid on there and then... Oh, you just nail it up there? Mm-hmm. Well, it's been up there so long, it's just tight. Now, it's probably rusted. See that one come off. See this? You just nail it up there. Isn't that cool? That's a little Pinterest idea right there. An outdoor playpen. <laughs> Nia's exercising over there. The wild cats. Jimmy lets his cats just swing out here. He feeds them, but he's just waiting for the coyotes to get them. Kind of sad, but a good old country way, I guess. Kitty cat. Kitty cat. He said that mommy ever got eaten by a coyote. Please tell me that's not urine inside of there. That's gasoline. Oh. That was a year and. <laughs> you gonna miss me? Uh, Are you gonna? Tell Papa say. Sweet for Bebo. Bebo. Are you gonna be obese? Bebo. Oh, I wanna buy bye. Bye. Bebo. I'm gonna miss you, chocolate face. <laughs> <laughs> you mean it, brownie. Brownie face. I mean, I love you so much. Have a pop on Bebo. Do you guys want to see what I got for thirty dollars at the yard sale today? I'm dying to show y'all. Hey. All of this for 30 bucks. That's a big steal. I think overall if I'd paid full price for all of this, it would have been at least $100. Luckily I do normally find my stuff for half off, so it still probably would have been about 55, 60 bucks. Okay, you wanna take a bath? Where's the bathtub? Let's go take a bath. After dropping Symphony off at my mom and dad's house, I went to Mardell and got some stuff for the new semester at Little Pillar. That's all the stuff that I got, the stuff you saw just now, and I am just super excited about it. So the youngest class, not the youngest, well there's nursery, toddler, and preschool, so the middle class, the toddlers, 
the curriculum I put together last semester just wasn't really going so well. It wasn't terrible from what I understand, but it wasn't like really super productive. So I got some new things. I thought why not have something there that they do every single week instead of trying to change it up each week to match the story. So I found some stuff from Melissa and Doug at really good prices by the way. And so these are the days of creation nesting blocks. And so each Sunday, the class will go over the days of creation and it'll be like a repetitive thing each Sunday. Then this is the best buy. I found these Melissa and Doug cube puzzles, but it's not just one puzzle. There are six different puzzles. And to go along with it, I got this Bible book, the Jesus Storybook Bible. Symphony also has that Bible, so I know the content that's inside and it's really good. It's great for getting the message of Jesus across to children and it's really nice to look at. I mean, it's bright, it's colorful. Look at the pages on the inside. It's just very artsy, the way that things are, you know, put together. And I'm excited to incorporate it into Little Pillar. Look how cool these are, guys. Day seven, day six, three, two, one. Sorry, the camera kind of cuts it off. Let's see here. Super interactive thing to do with toddlers. I mean, come on, what toddler doesn't like building a tower and then knocking it all over, all at the same time learning how our earth was created. Oh, I love it. It's bright, it's colorful, it's got animals and stars, a good contrast of darks and lights. Day's over now, guys. Thanks for coming along with us as usual. Did you guys like our new lip sync? Did you like it? It was a pretty good choice. Took us a while to decide. It's, there's actually fewer duets than you guys think out there. Disney duets. We're trying to stick with Disney. It took us about, how many takes did that take? How many takes did it take to get that take? <laughs> <laughs> I think it, it probably took, took about five. I was gonna say five, yep. You know what is so funny? Like oh. when we did our first lip sync, the you know, the Frozen one obviously, it was just like us having fun. It wasn't anything like, there was nothing attached to it for me. And like, as we keep doing lip syncs, I know that you guys are on the other side of the camera. And I'm telling you, every time the camera was like up on the dashboard, I would like freeze. I was she so nervous. nervous. She got so, I mean, she's like, I totally have now. We gotta do this. I have the phone now. We and I did, like this. without the camera, it was like perfect. Had it to a T. Now we're trying to look for a uh, Christmas Disney duet. We just found a really a challenge. cute one. We did, yeah. we did find a cute one. It's really cute. But we're still looking. That's gonna be our... That's our backup. backup. We're hoping to find like a, you know, just one that's like, yes, it's that one. This is like, we found one and it's like, okay, oh, hey, that's cute. Right. <laughs> so tomorrow, what do we got going on? I'm actually doing a photo shoot tomorrow of some viewers, some a couple of you guys. Um, their name is Brad and Catherine. They just got engaged. And they're coming all the way to Dallas from Louisiana. I'm not sure what part she told me, but I forgot. What? But I didn't know that. Yeah, they're driving five hours so oh, I can shoot their gosh. engagement photos. That's awesome. Thanks. All right, guys. We'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Don't forget, we love you. And remember to love each other. What are you going to be doing? This is probably going to start around noon. I'm going to have to leave the house by noon. Well, I didn't know that Sam had this photo shoot tomorrow, or I would have done all the errands I did tonight, tomorrow, I and spent the afternoon. all week. Uh, he was, no, yeah, okay. I, he did tell me a while ago. <laughs> <laughs> I just forgot about it. I just didn't realize that it was going to be like an all-day thing. But, I don't know, I kind of want to go with you and just walk around um, the park with the kids in the stroller, but it's going to be cold, so. Yeah, it's supposed to be cold. I don't know. I want to meet Brad and Catherine. That's not fair. <laughs>